Hi, I'm Seng. So today I will teach you split the bill in the same table or split the bill in the same bill and how to pay more than one different payment types. For example, using cash and boost together in the same bill. Okay, let's say in the table, you got two person order three items, but one of the item I want to pay by myself. So I swap here, click split or change bill. I click split by item and then make sure you click here and then you click split and pay once you split it in your table layout in table 6 where we got two bills or you can click here transaction to trace back your bill the table 6 for the 415 and table 6 416 or other than that you can use split table for example the table 2 got two items coffee and coffee cow and then you click split table you click here and click again and split and pay okay for pay using two different payment types click pay for example i want to pay cash for two ringgit i click two, cash and two ringgit cash in and i click for example boost i click two ringgit and cash in again and i click check out as you can see okay as you can see that i pay cash using two ringgit and i pay the boost by using two ringgit also other than that for example, if I order like this and then I click pay that boost for the 2 ringgit, I cash in but the 2 ringgit, I pay by cash by using 10 ringgit also can cash in and then it shows the amount to change so it's change 8 ringgit Okay, what if I want to pay using customer account so I click the I, select my customer and make sure that they got the account balance click apply, I click pay Customer account, for example, I want to charge for one ringgit and fifty cents for my account. Apply, and then the amount is one ringgit fifty cents. I pay by cash, cash in, and check out. So in the receipt, you will see that I pay by cash using two ringgit, and customer account I only charge one ringgit fifty cents. And then you can see that the credit balance is one hundred and thirty cents. That's all for today. Thank you.